bit of peace and quiet. No, just can't do that yet.
You're back. Do you have my things? I'm Nils, by the way. You were expecting me? Wasn't I? That's a pity. I can't remember, but I gave someone my shards to bring my belongings back to me. I thought that was you. Never mind. I guess we don't know each other then. I'm Eric, by the way. Didn't you just say your name was Nils? What are you talking about? Why would I say that? You must be confusing me with someone else. Do you have the things I asked you to get me? What are you talking about? What things? I... I don't know anymore. I know I had a few things with me, but then there were these... creatures that came out of nowhere. Then Nils came and rescued me. I thought you were Nils. Don't be ridiculous. I'm Aaron, like I told you. You're very forgetful. Anyway, he came and rescued me, and then I was here all of a sudden. Then he left me all alone. And he took my things, too. I think. About your things. Ah! You have them! Where'd you last see your things? I remember we stopped somewhere in the south together. On the edge of the crater, near a little lake, I think. I must have left all my things there. They were the only things that ever meant anything to me. Would you look for my things for me? What exactly are these things you're looking for? Well, they're everything that ever meant anything to me. Though I can't remember them so well right now. Aaron always made fun of me for carting everything around with me. He called me a hoarder. He told me to go on my own, but I can't. I could never survive on my own. I'd be totally screwed. I can't understand a word you're saying. Don't worry. Just ask Nils. He'll explain it all to you. I'll go look for your things. Okay, I thought you already had my things with you. <laughs> okay, thanks. I'll wait here.
That looks like the stuff that forgetful guy wanted me to find. I still haven't got everything. I should keep looking. I still haven't got everything. I should keep looking. Got everything. I should keep looking. That's everything, I think. I should go back to the Crater City. Shit. I don't know. Are these the things you were looking for? You found the... I... I... Uh, you found my things. They were everything that ever meant anything to me. So... Why aren't I happy? I only feel sad. Where'd you find my things? I found them on some corpses. Oh. Everything that ever meant anything to me. I... I think I remember now. There were creatures. They pushed Eric. And the blood... Blood was everywhere. I... I, I left them behind. I... Oh, hi. I'm Aaron, by the way. You are? And you just started to remember. Sorry, remember what? Your dead friends, the things you needed, and all that? Nope. No, I already have all I need. I'm happy. So, if you don't need anything else from me, I'm gonna go stretch my legs a bit. Maybe I'll go down to the nursery later and have a drink or something. Nice to meet you. Come by again sometime.
place is a fucking dump. It's the worst. What are you whining for? We got money, food, and a place to crash. You want to go back to roaming the... What do we do now? We're totally fucking broke! We keep going. That, uh, that tip about the castle... I really don't have time for you right now. I got boots and pockets full of nothing but holes. There's no way they'll let us in. Uh, forget your fucking boots. Those guys need people like us. You'll get some new kicks. I got both my eyes on you, you little shit. Don't you forget it. So what do I do now? I'm gonna go have a smoke. What you do is your business. Did you ever run oh, I, just, I, I can't stand that sort of man. If we don't put up some resistance, all is lost. I heard you shouldn't mess with them. What do I think of it? Better to keep that to myself. Well, the Buddy, you aren't allowed to be here. 
Fuck off! Maybe this will convince you to let me through? You know the deal. You weren't here. If I see you again, I'll throw you out on your ass. I never saw you. Well, I wasn't consulted on it. Again. I don't know either. Hey, Porter. The usual? Or you want to rent another room? Nope. This time, Brenda, I'm buying, not renting. Ah, Porter, come on. We talked about this. I can't afford to sell you a room. Besides, you ain't got no shards. You know what? I'll let you stay the night for free. Room's empty right now anyway. <laughs> no need. I found someone who made a very lucrative delivery for me. What do you say to 500 shards? Five? Hey, where'd you get so much money? I told you, I... Yeah, yeah. Shit, that's a lot of shards. Look, I'll think about it. I'll do the math and let you know. Then what if I said seven? Would you still have to think about it then? Jeez, Porter. Okay. If it's so important to you. 700 it is. Hand it over. You can go right upstairs. Room's all yours. Thank you so much. I bought a room from Brenda. Can't tell you how grateful I am. I'd still be living in squalor without you. Here's your share. Thanks for everything, my friend. Welcome to the nursery. What can I get you, hun? Hold on. This is the nursery? Yep. What were you expecting? Oh, wait. You didn't bump it to Cricket, did you? Maybe. I saw some asshat saying he was collecting donations. That little monster. I'm gonna have to change the name of this place one of these days because of him. You ain't the first he's pulled this on. If he ain't here yet, he's on his way. Do me a favor and punch him in his mouth. He keeps pulling that shit over and over. I'm up to here with it. Why do you call your tavern the nursery? Look around the place. Nothing but boys behaving bad. And they only get worse as the night goes on. And it's up to me to set them straight. Sometimes I feel less like an innkeeper and more like their mom. Those boys are nothing but overgrown babies with guns. Hence the name. So, what'll it be? How about some milk? With the healthy shot of the hard stuff, of course. <laughs> Give me something to drink. The nursery has everything you need. Take your pick. Ripped me off, asshole. The nursery is a tavern. Hey, hey, calm down, man. No need to freak out. I <laughs> well, guess you uh, figured out my scheme, huh? <laughs> uh, this is what I'd call uh, a teachable moment. You learn from your mistakes. Now, fuck off. I want to drink away your hard earned shards in peace. <laughs> my attention is needed elsewhere. Look, just take the loss, man. I pulled one over on you and you totally fell for it. Now, let me get smashed in peace. Just give me my money back and we can forget this ever happened. <laughs> Hell no! 
No, you parted with those shards of your own free will. You just pissed cause you are an idiot. I mean, who'd be so fucking stupid to think we'd have an actual nursery here? <laughs> ah, now fuck off. Give me my shards back or you'll get a black eye and a broken nose. Fuck that. You really want some of this? Bring it on, asshole! Well, can I have my shards back? Oh, yes! Shit! Fuck, man! Oh, you really don't pull your punches! It's just a few shards, man. Shit, if they mean that much to you, take what I got. Just stop hitting me. Deal. Well, now I guess I'm done drinking since you cleaned me out. Thanks for nothing, you dill hole. See you later. Wow, you really beat the shit out of Cricket. Mind you, I'm not complaining. Maybe now that bum can stop dragging my tavern down with his shit. Have one on the house. is that I won't have to share the dough with you. Now fuck off, you candy-ass little prick! You're obviously not an outlaw. So fuck off, got it? Why does it matter whether or not I'm an outlaw? Look, I got a deal going. I provide the outlaws with kit. And I get to sit on my ass up here without having to worry about getting robbed or whatever. And I'm sticking to that deal. So you'd sell me stuff if I was an outlaw? I'd sell you gear, weapons, and even teach you how to make your own kims. You figured that out pretty quick. I'm proud of you. But you're not an outlaw, so our business here is done. Good to see you. What goods have you got? But of course... Jax? I don't fucking believe it. Never thought I'd run into you here. Hector? I thought I'd never see you again. 
I know. Back then, I said we wanted to cross the mountains, start a new life. But, as you can see, we didn't make it very fucking far. Why are your gate guards handing out a Lexit? Ah, Darius is following instructions. I'm pleased to hear that. That doesn't answer my question. I'm just a generous soul. Of course. And now the real reason? <laughs> Fine. I guess I can't fool you. It's not like I'm giving shit away. I earned my cut. First of all, the shards stay here. Whatever I give out at the gate, it gets spent inside it. But even if it doesn't, my men take care of the rest. Don't need more than a few fast fingers to get back my property plus a tidy profit. They think I'm a savior, and curse their luck while owing me one. <laughs> Devious. Hey, we all gotta make a living. You get it. How the hell'd she wind up working with the outlaws? Well, the Claws always had a big expansion plan. We wanted to build a society from the ground up, a place without war. Thought it might be easier to get settled in the lands beyond the mountains. But we stopped here to rest, and our guide fucked off. Never came back. Without him, we didn't know how to cross the mountains without dying. So we got stuck here. One thing led to another, and here I am at the top of the heap. Life sure is fucking funny sometimes, huh? <laughs> As a member of the Claws, you must be able to teach me something about being a pickpocket. Sure. What do you want to know? Can I join you? You want to be an outlaw? Huh. Well, I guess it could work, but would you be willing to work as an informant? Depends on what you mean by informant. Looks like you haven't chosen a faction yet. We already have informants among the Morcons and the Berserkers, but we need someone to earn the trust of their higher-ups. So if you want to join us, you gotta make contact with my people. I can't tell you any more than that. You know our cells work alone. I can't tell you exactly where they're hiding. So, join up with the Berserkers or the Morcons. When you're there, find my people. They'll tell you everything you need to know. Hey, it was great to see you again, Jax. Sorry, but I gotta go. Got shit to do. My attention is needed elsewhere. Don't go pocketing anything!
be that often. You can't do anything wrong. The enemy is coming. Whatever we do. There's my way, and there's the wrong way. I don't believe that 800 Alexit is too much to ask, considering the wealth of some of your clientele. Can't you see I'm busy? Maybe you could fuck off! That's more than half my take! You can't be serious! I'll be right there. The Blade can stop his protection at any time, if that's what you want. To be at the mercy of any number of unsavory types. Okay, okay. I'll pay up. Uh, I knew you were smart the moment I laid eyes on you. I'll see you next week. So, how can I help you? I've got some new potions in stock. Feel free to take a look at the merchandise. I heard you talking with that Blade guy. He giving you trouble? Yeah. I was robbed a while back. Half of my goods were stolen. Next day, this guy shows up saying he'll protect me if I pay him. Everyone knows he's the one going around robbing people and killing off all the business. Then he shows up demanding payment for his so-called protection. That guy needs his ass kicked. <laughs> Tell me about it. All I could do is hire my own protection. But I can't afford that. Not with all the protection money I paid a blade. I could take care of this blade guy for you. Like I said, I can't pay anyone. Or are you planning on helping for free? Yeah, I'll help you for free. Really? You'd do that for me? But why? What do you get out of it? I don't like people taking advantage of those weaker than them. Thank you so much. I'll be glad when Blade finally stops this shit. What should I do with Blade? You want your money back? No. I just want him to leave me alone. But be careful messing with him. There's a reason people turn a blind eye to his business. It might not be good for much, but... What he is good for is fighting. Where can I find Blade? He struts around the city bullying people. You're bound to run into him sooner or later. So, what can I do for you today? Do you have a name? I prefer not to. A name is like blood. It just sticks to you and attracts vultures. One little slip up, and it's on someone's shit list. But your ass can't get sunburned if you stay in the shade.
Blade has no time for bums like you. So how about you kindly fuck off out of here? What did you just call me? What? I called you a bum! <laughs> a vagabond, a hobo! Oh, what are you gonna do about it, bum? I want you to leave Vicky alone. Vicky? Vicky? Oh, oh, let me think, um... Oh, you mean that bitch who doesn't pay her debts? Yeah. Has she sent you here to threaten me, or worse? There doesn't have to be violence. Maybe we can work something out. If you want me to stop collecting shards from her, you'd better have a very good offer. You know what? I'm just gonna punch you in the face. You know, I can't stand big mouths like you. <laughs> It'll be a pleasure to whip your ass. What's taking so long? Someone's oh. shitting their pants. Weapons of Good to see you aren't that stupid. I hope that you're going to leave Vicky alone now. Oh, shit. Yes, yes. <laughs> Blade admits defeat. Oh, that was a damn good beating you gave me. In the future, I'll pass. Smart move. Whatever. I've got plenty of other sources of income. Vicky's money was just a drop in the ocean. If you don't need anything else, I'll be off. And if I see you again, it'll be too soon. Maybe you should tell me who you are. They call me Blade, because I cut up people who ask too many stupid questions. So what are you doing here? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I'm patrolling my territory. So if you don't have any levy to pay me, get the fuck out of here. Blade won't be demanding any more protection money from you. You really did it. I owe you. I'm so grateful to you, doing what you did without asking for shards. It's special. Hopefully now I'll be able to get back on my feet again soon. You're welcome. Pleasure doing business with you. If you're ever in the area and want to buy or sell something, you know where to find me. See you around. Thanks again, for everything. What you got? Only the best here.
Well, let's talk later, when I have more time. You should get to know the camp in the meantime. Everything has changed since the last time you were here. believe the rumors they left. Well, late is blocked. I don't believe it. That really tasted like shit. I want to learn from you. Let's get this over with. There's my way, and there's the wrong way. Come in here with me. You believe the rumor they left. It had to happen. No point dwelling on it. Apparently, they're still in Goliath. You better be quiet. That's a damn idiot. I don't believe it. Apparently, there's still a 